Hi there. Since we still have a little bit of lovinette left, I figured I would show you an easy to do uh, pantry pasta. So all you need is some lemon, olive oil, anchovies, which is a huge must for any pantry, um, garlic, just a clove, more if you like, and if you have some, some good parm or pecorino romano. So what you're gonna wanna do is give a rough mince to your garlic clove. And this garlic is just going to be sauteed in the oil and you're gonna bring out all the aromatics of that garlic. All right, and then we're gonna take some of these anchovies. I'm just going to do one, because I'm making pasta for one. Um, one of these fillets goes a long way. Um, it has a really nice brininess to it, so you really don't need to add salt to your pasta. This will be the seasoning agent, agent and um, it has so much depth of flavor. This was um, a tip that I got from my brother who is the executive chef of Mini Mott and Mott Street um, early on um, as just one of those great basic pa pantry staple items. So you'll see the anchovies, you kind of mince it like this and it'll disintegrate actually as you saute it in the oil. Great, now I'm gonna bring you to the um, pan station. Okay, so now we have a pan that is warm. It's not screaming hot because we're using olive oil and we don't want to burn the garlic, so I'm going to put some olive oil into the pan, I'd say about a tablespoon and a half, and then we're going to put in both the anchovies and the minced garlic, and we're going to let that infuse the oil. We're going to cook that down for a few minutes. Again, if your oil is too hot, then it will burn the garlic very quickly, so we don't want that. Looks like this in the pan. And meanwhile, while that's, um, so while it's simmering in the oils here, the garlic and the anchovy, I'm gonna wanna take this lemon here and zest it get all the goodies off of that rind. There's so much flavor. That's where all the essential oils are. You see that build up right there? We're gonna put the pan. I'm gonna turn my heat down. Oh, got a little oil in my face. That's why I be wearing apron. This smells so good already. Let me show you. So, while this is going, because it's an olive oil based sauce, honestly, I would add um, some canned tomatoes to it if I had some. I don't have any on hand. Um, so what I'm going to do is um, maybe bump it up a notch with some Pecorino Romano. Similar flavor profile to that of Parmesan. It's a harder cheese. Um, has a nice salty, uh, briny flavor profile. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna hold on that because we're gonna put the pasta in first. Chopsticks because I can't find a tongue right now. You're gonna to wanna to put the pasta into the sauce. I'm gonna to want to integrate it. If you have any fresh herbs like parsley, toss that in as well. And then the final topper, we're gonna to do some Pecorino Romano. It doesn't have to have cheese, but just 
adds a nice flavor profile to it. Do a quick little squeeze of lemon. And there we go. You have a lemon anchovy pasta. And it smells delightful. Enjoy.